Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are looking at Min.io and Rook. And the reason I want to look at them is because uh, you might see them as options on the exam. And if you know what they are, it's going to really help you determine what the right answer is. Rook and Min.io are two things that we do not cover in the fall longs because they're a little bit too complex to set up. Um, and they're interesting because, like, they are basically, um, I would say, like, special types of storage. Um, but we'll talk about what they are so you kind of understand. So Rook turns distributed storage systems into self-managing, self-scaling, self-healing storage services. It automates the task of a storage administrator, so deployment, bootstrapping, configuration, provisioning, scaling, upgrading, mitigation, disaster recovery, monitoring, and resource management. And it can use things like Cepher FS, I believe, and things like that. But basically, as it says, it's distributed storage systems. Okay, so when you think of pods, pods are generally backed by block storage. But uh, this kind of stuff is not attached to a specific pod. It's just distributed storage that you would use. Um, maybe this would be for like data pipeline workloads or things like that. I don't know. I didn't. I haven't deployed Rook. But I just know that I've seen the word on the exam, and so I wanted to point out kind of what it was. Min.io is a lot more clear to me, its use case. So it offers high-performance S3 compatible object storage. So it's essentially object storage, um, and it has a, um, what says S3 compatible? It basically works just like S3. So it's native Kubernetes, so Min.io is the only object storage suite available in every public cloud. Uh, I, I, I mean, Anywhere that you can deploy Kubernetes, basically, uh, you can use it. So Min.io is software-defined and 100% open source under uh, new APGL version 3. So I really like the idea of Min.io. It's, I really like S3, so uh, Min.io is an easy sell for me. Um, but yeah, that's all those two things are, okay?